What is happening, everybody? Guess where I'm at? Propane Headquarters USA, Vancouver, Washington. Let's do a quick tour, a quick hello. Hey, Vic, here's the boss man right here. Hey, welcome to Propane. Yeah, how you doing? Doing all right. You wanna give us a quick little tour? Or are we allowed to see the behind the scenes operation here? No. Okay, <laughs> next video. We're still getting settled into our, uh, our space here, but... Uh... That's Kat. Whoa, hey Kat, how you doing? Good. Well, what kind of roles do you do here? I do the customer service and sales. All right, so this is the this is the woman you'll be and chatting with. She'll be answering all your questions. Procurement. <laughs> all right. Procurement specialist. <laughs> wow, look at this. Factory. Get built up and shipped out. Parts coming in today and we're kind of getting things sorted out. Whoa, amazing good photos so I see all the different colors all the different options huh so this is this yeah. is kind of what propane does for the customers yeah, tell choose, me about that you choose your grip color saddle color we've got a decal so you can choose your decal color as well customization so really, huh yeah you can really make everything matchy matchy very cool well anything else we should see real fast uh, just everything else is top secret yeah top secret can't <laughs> can't go past that line <laughs> Okay, so I really actually am going to cross that imaginary line into the behind the scenes zone. So we can get to why you may have clicked on this video. We are going to be unboxing the Propane Rage downhill bike. First one in the United States, right here. So let's get to it. Okay, so this thing literally just showed up a few minutes ago. I have arrived just in time to meet it. Got some protection here. Downhill Newman wheels with a 107 millimeter hub. Schwabby tires. This is one of the factory builds, but I'm gonna switch out a couple of parts later on down the road. Woo. There it is, the Propane Rage. You can see these bikes come very assembled. A minimum effort is required to kind of get the wheels on and get the cockpit together. So let's, uh, let's pull that protection off and slap it together. Check this beauty out. is everybody i am so excited look at this beautiful beautiful bike some of the cool things i'm noticing about this frame right off the bat integrated fork bumpers crucial in my opinion this downhill bike is mullet compatible how cool is that with the flip of a switch pro 10 suspension fully floating active suspension and then when it comes to the wheelbase what's cool is 445 and 460, so that's 15 millimeters of spread in the short and long mode with the wheelbase. So that's gonna be super playful if we take it out to the desert and if we hit some races, put it back in long mode. And then when you're adjusting the wheelbase, what I just found out here is instead of swapping a whole brake mount, you can simply just unscrew and then move it up and then re-screw it back into the other holes. So you don't have to be having multiple parts. Pretty awesome. This extra large propane rage has a reach of 495 millimeters, a head tube angle of 63 degrees, a top tube length of 619 millimeters. In the short wheelbase mode, 1305 millimeters, and in long wheelbase mode, 1320 millimeters. With 215 millimeters of rear shock travel and the option to go full 29er or mixed wheel set, it should be good times ahead. And there it is. 2022 Propane Rage. Full 29er, extra large frame. I set it up in the short mode. So this is how it comes out of the box. This is one of the options Propane offers. I'm gonna switch up some parts like the wheels and the suspension, but for now, gonna go give it a rip. So thanks for following along later on.